Not actual gameplay, though. <laughs> That'd be absurd. It was a spontaneous creative decision made after years of careful research. Being really old and almost dying a bunch doesn't count as research. Almost dying is the best way to learn how not to die. Besides, it worked, didn't it? How much longer for the upload? Uh, a few more minutes. Hey, start up. Try it with hot sauce. You'll like it. Trust me. No, no, no. Do not trust him. Whoa. Where's this coming from? It's coming from you back on the ship saying, trust me, we're professionals. We'll stick to the plan. We can do this. And then... Uh, neither. Firewalk? <laughs> that was not the plan. Technically, it was a plan. It just wasn't the same plan that we started with. If we don't leave with this blue light... Amar, we will. We will. I feel like this is going to end up being like a be arena outside. shooter type thing, like Overwatch and whatnot. Uh, no or team-based shooter. We'll be taking this off your hands. What? This? Funny. Nice. I like their, uh, their designs. Oh, 100%. It's, that's what it, Firewalk is. That look cool. I am developing a taste for destruction. It's a cool little sucky sucky. This wasn't the one we started with. It is. It does right. feel like if Better Guardians met right. Overwatch. Goods delivered. I send everyone their cut. Ooh, yeah. So do you like carry it around with you for emergency bland situations or whatever? Hey, Mara. Hmm? Don't joke about something like this. <laughs> Our next job is somewhere with less scaffolding. We'll have no scaffolding. Zero scaffolding. I, I promise. <sighs> We were apart for so long. I, I thought I'd never feel your fiery embrace again. You suck. Oh, it doesn't feel like Star Wars to me. I don't know why. Oh, is Firewalk the studio? Concord is a 5v5 first person oh. shooter set in the vibrant sci fi universe of the Concord Galaxy. In Concord, from the moment you log on, you are part of the crew of the North Star, a group of guns for hire known in our galaxy as Free Gunners. Free gunners are those lucky enough to be free to roam the stars. Yeah, five v five jobs on worlds across wild space, where they face other fiercely competitive free gunner crews. Here's the very first look at the gameplay of Concord. I just, man, making a game like that—it's hard work, but it's our work, and we don't take it for granted. Being a free gunner, you're going up against Marvel rivals, well, Overwatch. You're free. Right on target. So many other games, like. Yeah, you have a shot at making something of themselves a chance to be the someone. that riot game need a second to fix myself up why not and in the wilds 
It's anyone's game. You won't survive on your own. Target blinded! Finally, to battle. His name is Starchild. Together, we're going to make our mark on this galaxy. I mean, it doesn't look bad. It just the crew is gathering. Would you like to join us for game night with Concord? We lean on the strengths and background of our team to make a tight, well balanced FPS that feels great to play. We focused a ton of our attention and our tech on building a strong gameplay foundation of tight core movement, precise visceral shooting, and expressive abilities. We ended up finding ourselves influenced a lot by fighting games and even strategy games in the interesting way that the asymmetry of their characters makes every fight, every matchup feel really different. You're not gonna say the you're... asymmetry of the characters really pushing you're... the possibility space of two different characters colliding. It's all about creating opportunities for improvisation. That's where we can get out of the way and let players find their own magic. We also have abilities that are meant to have impact beyond direct combat. Deployable gear that can persist throughout a full game. So whether that's multiple rounds of a mode, or multiple respawns across a match. There are healing pads, bullet blocking domes, explosive traps, lane blocking walls, all kinds of ways to support your team or disrupt your enemies. Coordinated teams can set up and plan ahead, and depending on where and when it happens, players can shift the battlefield to their advantage. We've got everything from mystics and medics to gunslingers and sparked robots. Every character brings their own unique personality, skills, and wide-ranging perspectives to the crew. Every week, when you log into Concord, you will be welcomed with a new cinematic vignette that will give you a chance to see our characters off the job. They will feature ongoing narrative arcs that grow the characters' stories and relationships and unpack the broader Concord galaxy. That's kind of cool. Kissing a tchotchke. We're excited to share that we'll be hosting a pre-launch beta in July, followed by Concord's global launch on August 23rd, 2024. Hey, that's my birthday. Thanks. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't, it definitely doesn't look bad. I just think that there's so many, like, I don't, the character designs are cool though. I like those. I just, uh, there's just so many games like that, you know? Thanks, John. Thanks for 41 months, dude. Imagine using Discord to play Concord. Cord. Got a war finally on PC, baby. So you can play something new. Oh, I can't. I'll be at a, a rehearsal dinner that day, I think. Hi, Dove. War is coming. The prophecies say Fimblewinter leads to Ragnarok. Unlocked frame rates! Oh! I hate that there's like so many gamers that are like, Oh my god, yeah! Man, I'm just so not a technical person when it comes to, uh, to stuff with games. I am getting married. Yep. Why did someone say it? Not because it is written. Uh, 
Oh yeah, not my rehearsal oh. dinner. No, no, no. Soldiers and officials alike oppress the people for personal gain. And the people must turn to thievery for food. Perhaps this is heaven's way of lamenting the state of the land. Not as much in single play. I mean, you're God of War. Like. But even so, someone must act. Is this another Dynasty Warriors? Yeah. When was the last time they did a Dynasty Warrior game? I feel like they just do the, like, uh, Musou or whatever they're called type games now. I thought it was Assassin's Creed. Dynasty Warriors Origins! I love games that are franchises that are like Momo, 20 years old. I think I was dreaming. QAF. It wasn't a dream. <gasps> we were really transported to Miraland. The path of a stylist is never easy. So, are you ready for it? Ready. We're ready. Ready. The life of a stylist is never easy, they said. This looks super cute. I have no idea what's going on. But it looks so cute. Oh, big fucking eyes. The mat, yeah. Infinity, infinity Nikki or is infinity awaiting you yo every time rainhound comes to my stream rainhound says that they have issues Stars. as if it's me <laughs> every single time i have seen the miracles you so claim until the towering shadow I pray for their grace, but all that came were inferior shades. Oh. Why do we have to bear the consequences of such power? Time. War. Mortality. These essences shall not fall into your treacherous hands. <laughs> Oh, that looks dope. Remember, no matter what happens, we did not betray this world. That looks great. Next year. That looks really cool. It looks like a gaming, uh, it, like a Souls like Kajadi would. Yep. It's VR, so like. 
break the curse. But I was a fool. There is no hope here. And the gods that walk among us thirst for death. in my veins begs me to kill. That was, that was the stupidest life. <laughs> the poison in my veins begs me to kill. Thought I could be a hero. But heroes don't survive the Forsaken Lands. I like the monsters the... do. Oh. I like the like Shadow of the Colossus vibes. There was like a weak point where he was tugging on the thing. Like that's kind of cool. I've never I don't really play VR, never played VR, so a lot of those games are Yeah, the dialogue was a little goofy, out of context, but... Yeah! Yo! Yo, give me a alien game in V- Okay. I would a thousand percent play that and make sure I was wearing pants that I don't care about. Hi everyone, I'm Sean Benson. I'm back on State of Play to Hi, Sean Benson. more exciting titles coming to PlayStation. Starting with a highly anticipated You gonna play that? Shooter, playable soon if you buy me a spot. VR? I'm not sure it's worth getting. Yeah, right. Like, I don't know if I want a VR, but... Blade? Wolverine? Nope, never mind. It's rivals. All realities converge here. Destiny awaits. Honestly, this game looks better than Overwatch because you know these these characters. You know what I mean? Is that Adam Warlock? I think so. Yeah, hella. Who needs a power up? Free fire zone. Embrace the chaos. Insignificant attacks. It is third person Overwatch, but Marvel. Yeah. got symbiotes on him oh that is cool oh that is that's dope that actually that was cool That's a take on Galactus, I guess. And it's on PlayStation. Yeah, I'd play that. I'd play that for sure. That looks really fun. I wonder if they would charge uh, $40 for a skin though.
60 bucks. Yep. Yep. And so Rainhound Everett Stream complains about ad, getting an ad and complains about there's their stream getting stuck. Hello, friends and fans. I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual yeah! winter getaway. Until dawn! <laughs> oh, nice one. You can't hide from me, Michael. Oh, you're going down. Oh. It means so much to me that we're all still here together. Fight the break of I feel like someone's watching us. There's no one out there. Let's make this one trip we will never forget. Oh. It's getting up there now, but it's a great game. No, no, this is uh, like a remaster of the first one. It's so good. Yeah, I loved it. PS5 and PC. Th that's weird. They didn't even call it. It's just until dawn. It's not like a rem. Interesting. So I guess it's just a port. I feel like I can't play a Path of Exile because I will I'll just like get sucked in and lose a week of my life. But each day descends further into madness. Famine and plague besiege us. The very earth is being poisoned. The Count's men, once our protectors, have turned on us. And now they come. Oh, that was dope. More couch co-op in games, please. Yeah, Path of Exile 2. That's even better. Early access late this year. Nice. The couch co-op part is dope. Like, I I wish everything had couch co-op. <laughs> Do you have a fart? Excuse me. Whoop! I knew it was gonna oh, be sorry. at this. I, I was just. It's okay. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm kind of lost. I'm looking for Silent Hill. I think you should stay away. This town, there's something wrong with it? Is it dangerous? Maybe. I'll be careful. I'm not lying. 
guess I don't really care if it's dangerous or not. I'm going either way. No. You shouldn't be here. I promise. Tell him I'll be good, please. No. Please. That looks pretty good to me. announced this next game last December, offering just a glimpse of what's in store for their celebrated franchise. Today, I am so excited to share the first full gameplay trailer for Monster Hunter Wilds. It kind of looked like uh, like the com the combat kind of reminded me of Last of Us, to be honest with you. As soon as we find a good spot, we can get things set up and ready to go. And then we can get started. This is gonna be great. You bet. I hope we find them soon. See, I'm not really like a monster hunter, never really gotten into it, but it always looks so good. Now to lead it away from the pack, we'll make for the desert. Xenos, thanks for the sub, baby. What's going on, dude? Long time no see. Takes a bit to get used to. I remember really liking when we we did a stream of it for uh, like a big one, and I thought it was cool. But now commencing the hunt by order of the guild. yeah, that's what I felt. Is I needed more story. Well, I'm glad to see you're not immediately turned off by it, Tomas. Oh, that was cool. Oh, that was neat. Thank you, sir. I mean, that looks pretty dope. I just feel like Monster Hunter is such a specific gameplay loop. Monster Hunter World save data bonus. Nice. See you guys. Thanks for you for the raid. I appreciate it. Or not the raid. Well, coming on the raid, I should say. Yeah! I knew it! A new ast another Astrobots game? A new Astrobots game? Oh, heck yeah. Heck yeah. Yeah. 
No, there that that the game was like a you know a, a little demo of the PlayStation 5. But it was it was really good. So they they're making one. Yeah, it was. Nice. Oh, that's cool. Yeah! Parappa the Rappa! Oh, that's great. Is that a Rampage reference? Nice Shadow of the Colossus. It's very like Crash Bandicoot Spyro feeling. Ha, yeah! Yeah, that looks great. September 6th. Nice. Yeah, those are fun. Those are like fun little platformers. Surprisingly fun. The PS5 sure one was surprisingly fun. For more on the games you just saw, as well as PlayStation.com for the latest on Days of Play. This global celebration runs through June 12th with deals on PlayStation Store, great new content coming to PlayStation Plus, and much more. A little, a little sad about no Final Fantasy IX remake, but that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. I thought that looked pretty good. The, you said the Astro games are surprisingly fun. They are. I mean, I was, I was pleasantly surprised when I played uh, the one on PS5. I ended up getting all the trophies for it because I was like, dope. Yeah, that was great. Uh, I'm kind of surprised how good... I think Rivals looks really good. Uh, the Concord game, I feel like, is going to come out and it's going to... No one's going to... Which is too bad. But I feel like... I feel like the game just feels like what we've seen from a bunch of other stuff that's already popular in the market. I don't know why you would switch game, you know what I mean? If it's very similar... You got the Riot game. You got the... Um, uh, and yes, Psionic, I did. It's not going to mean anything, but... Now you need the transmission, which starts... I think it starts uh, right after this. 